your boy, Mr. Williams, and today, I was at the gun range. I have to shoot, I need to learn how to shoot better. Sooner or later, I'm going to be going to some tactical training, that's my next step that I'm going to do. But I have to get some practice in, you can hear them shooting in the background. And, uh, man, alright, so I'm going to be putting up some pictures of my targets, and I'm going to put some labels in, so y'all can see how good I was shooting. By the way, this is my third time shooting. Third. I'm doing this because I'm supposed to be getting my concealed license. And uh, I've already went through the whole shebang. I've already passed. I'm pursuing two. Once my license come in, best believe I'm going to start concealing and carrying and all the other stuff. Sorry, but that's the sound I love right there. There's a, quite a bit of big brother. Anyway, so. My wife, she's the one that's teaching me how to actually shoot and all this stuff. And she's the first one that got me to come out to these, this gun range. And I fell in love with it ever since. I don't know. I've been shot at before, so I've been really hesitant on guns. Not this time. I think, I'm, I think with the things going on in the world today, I need to be able to keep my family safe. That's, I mean, that's another reason why I started doing this. I don't know. It's, get, it's getting pretty hell, hellacious out here. And I think I'm going to start coming out here a lot more. So I am going to be vlogging today. And so far, right now, just got done shooting. Post some pictures up here in a second. See you in a bit. Alright, let's talk about how you can get your concealed license. First and foremost, in Texas, you can open carry, but to get, you need to get your license to do concealing. For me, I would like to say concealing is probably better to do because if you don't conceal, everybody will know that you have a gun and it'll make it a little bit, I mean, I guess it was per, persuade them not to, but you got people like me that think that they're invincible. I uh, believe me, I think I'm invincible. And uh, we'll be like, if something was to go down and this person was to shoot, I can stop this person. I can get to him before he takes off shooting because I know he has a gun. I can probably take it from him. So if it was concealed, you wouldn't even think about it. And if something was to go down, like someone like me, but in a bad way. They're, they're, what's we're looking for? They're rolling up on the wrong person, not knowing that this person has a gun. So concealing is probably better. Anyway, so let's get started on how you get, the, uh, how you go ahead and get your license for to conceal. Um, first, you want, uh, you. I mean, the first way I did it, I got me an instructor, which cost me and my fiance probably about a hundred and something dollars to get go through the class, which is a five-hour class. And uh, you pa you need to make sure you pass the range. You need to make sure you pass the class. Uh, know your know your work. And I mean, basically, I mean, there's some classes out there. There's like three days long classes. I'm just glad mine was a five day long class. And uh, afterwards, after you pass and you did all what you're supposed to be doing. Texas.org or something like that. I can't. <sighs> sorry, I'm sorry that I can't remember. I'll put it in a link. Uh, I mean, I'll put it in the description. And so you go there, you look up license uh, to conceal gun license, and you go on there. You put in this. I mean, you pay another forty dollars, so the state can recognize that that's what you're doing. Then they'll ask you for handprints. So you have to go get your handprints. And uh, man, I am scatterbrained right now. I, I've already had this excitement, and now my mind is just everywhere. So you get your fingerprinted. They send it into the state, so they'll have your fingerprints and everything else. And then it will take about. Uh, it can take 
up, I mean, it takes as little as two, and it's seven days up to us right now with everything going seven weeks, six to seven weeks. I'm hoping mine don't come in at no six to seven weeks. I'm just hoping mine's come in within the next seven days. Um, well, it's like four or five days now, but uh, I'm hoping mine's come in pretty soon. And then, perks of having this stuff is, instead of when you buy purchase your gun, the gun you're purchasing, since the state already recognizes that you have you are able to get your license because there is nothing on your record and all that other stuff, you don't even have to wait to buy a gun. You can go buy a gun and get it off the rack. Guns are expensive, but you get what you pay for. Eh. But overall, that's some. That was just some knowledge I can give y'all, like just in case that just this is something that y'all wanting to do. Uh, I'll come back to y'all in a moment. YouTube, so I'm back, and today I'm up under my. I can't even think of what it's called right now. I'm, in, I'm feeling still in my chair. Got my kids out here cleaning and learning how to mow and stuff like that. It's gonna be. A, it's a wonderful day to be outside. I mean, social distancing and all that, all that, all that other jazz. You know, it doesn't matter. So I'm gonna get back to what I was doing, and then I'll be back. All right, so. I just got them finishing the rafters so far. I haven't done the outside yet, but it's starting to look good. I, I'm really impressed with myself. So the next thing I'm about to do is uh, I'm going to stabilize this little area here, these two right here, because I need it to be able to support the door that's going to be here. So that's my next step. So anyway, I don't know where I'm going to have y'all. Where I'm going to have y'all? Uh, well, I don't know where I'm going to come back and talk to y'all yet today, but. I mean, if I don't, peace. And if I do, come to talk to y'all. It's more of a treat for y'all. All right. See ya.